Hi, it's Janet from Uncommon Core. I'm here to do the second in my video series entitled A Common Teacher Talks About Common Core. Now, the first thing I want to make clear, when I use the term common, I do not mean average. I don't consider myself an average teacher. Actually, I consider myself an uncommon teacher. And the same is true with Common Core. I think some teachers are a little put off by the term common, thinking that common means average standards, uh, that we're kind of dumbing down what we expect our kids to do, and that's not it at all. Their main goal was to create rigorous, challenging standards. And they are, I've read them. And we'll go over them in the series of, uh, in this video series that I'm going to do. What they mean by common is that they've created a set of standards that we can all have in common. At this point, 46 states have signed on. So that means 46 states will have similar, well, not even similar, will have these same expectations for their students. And you know why this is good? It's because it's good for our students. They are not going to stay locally. They're going to move around within our states. They're going to move around among our states. They're even going to move and live internationally. So therefore, they need to have similar, uh, they need to be able to meet similar expectations in each of these places. And Common Core does that for us. Now, as far as the core part goes, these are the core standards, the essential things kids need to know. I think some teachers are a little afraid that it's going to put us in some sort of box and we can't be creative, but Common Core in their documentation makes it very, very clear. Again, these are the essential standards. They are not all of the standards. There's other things that we will be conveying to our students. And so we still have that teacher's freedom to do what we think is right with our students. And so that's Common Core from a common teacher's perspective. And I would love for you to become part of the conversation. We're on Twitter at Teach Uncommon. And we also have a web page, Uncommon Ed.com, if you would like to email us. I will see you again for the third video on Common Core.